Record for the fastest one day international hundred, A.B. de Villiers supreme skill, invention and destructive hitting means he is one of the most talented batsmen the game has ever seen. Good shot, beautiful shot, nice and straight, mid off was straight as well, but he's uh, played that superb. A.B. de Villiers is someone who plays, I think as we all know, on a completely different planet to most. But A.B. de Villiers, he, he pretends in his own mind that he's batting inside a cardboard box. So he doesn't worry too much about his feet, he doesn't get big strides in, doesn't get well back and across. He's just in a, in a, in a good sized cardboard box and makes sure that everything is under his eyes and his, and his hands are in the right place and everything's nice and tight. But relies on his balance, relies on his head position, uh, and then relies importantly on his hands. If you play under your eyes, you, firstly you give yourself, uh, get ahead of yourself if they to be hit. I think that is his main aim with playing in the box. About him, obviously everyone knows his power and his ability to change the game. But technically, he's, he's really smart, you know, and he reads the game well. He'll, you can see often he'll be, you know, getting into tight positions, working hard, and then he'll change his style a little bit and, and off his pads Mitchell Starks getting at the swing style I think it's difficult to get him out and I think it's even more difficult to contain him because uh, he scores all around the ground he's very good at, uh, at at manipulating the areas in which he wants to score he really puts the bowlers under pressure because he's very aggressive uh, he's very quick on his feet as well so uh, I think for him uh, the key is if he bats for a long time, the scoring rate just climbs and he takes the game away from the opposition. And the Villiers goes flat and hard. Well, there's a street smart 100 from A.B. de Villiers. A.B. de Villiers is like a ballroom dancer. The footwork is immaculate. So he just gets into line and hits anything out of sight that needs to be hit. He uses his feet again. That is a gorgeous shot. He's got that ability to, to, to put the bowlers under pressure. You know, they, they're thinking, oh, I'm bowling to A.B. de Villiers, and you sort of bowl more bad balls than you probably would normally bowl to a guy that's just holding himself back a little bit, and that puts you under immense pressure as a bowler. He can play 360 degrees. Uh, no captain feels safe uh, with a field placing. No bowler, you know, feels that you know he can pin him down at all. Yes, at the test level, maybe he might be just a little bit worse. But in a limited overs format, um, you know, he just goes for it from from the world. He's expanded the entire range of shots. He's brought in some new shots as well, like the reverse sweep, the switch hit. Uh, that's that's what uh, he, his his major contribution to cricket has. And he's played most of them today in this fantastic innings 108 uh, from the way he plays I love the positions he gets into his foot movement uh, it ends up being nice and still his hands get into a really good position and then he plays nice and straight down the line um, you know cricket and why people score runs the application um, their concentration the hand-eye coordination all those things you can't really explain